welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be doing the challenge recipe card on Khan Academy Computer Programming. Um, and before we get on with this video, I just want to say that I saw you guys' comments on my other Khan Academy videos, and you guys have been saying how helpful these videos are for you guys, so I decided to do them again. Let's just get right into the video. So this is the challenge recipe card and the first step to this challenge is that you have to change the recipe title, recipe servings, and recipe ingredients. Um, so for my recipe, I'm going to do sushi, but you can do whatever you want. Also, you don't have to change the recipe servings, but you can if you want, but I'm not going to. Um, so for the recipe ingredients, um, sushi is usually made out of rice and seafood, um, unless you're eating vegetable sushi. Um, but yeah, um, let's go into the next step. So the next step has some series of steps that you have to do in order to complete the next step. So the first thing that you're going to do is erase the variables for each one. So var, var, let's erase that, okay. Var, let's erase that, erase that, okay. Um, then, instead of using this equal symbol, you're going to use the colon um, like this for each one. And then, instead of having the semicolon over here for each one, you're going to do a comma. And then, you're going to um, change this by taking off the recipe in the front. So recipe, recipe, and recipe. So that's it for that part, and then you're going to put this into a function, a customized function, called var recipe, or you can call it whatever you want, but I'm going to call it recipe, lowercase. Recipe, okay, and then do equals, so plus, equals, do that, and then over here, just close the variable. As you can see over here, there are three mistakes, and the reason we have three mistakes is because over here, um, this is what like makes this code work, um, and if this code changes, obviously this code is not going to work. So we have to change this in order to complete the second step. So you have to complete the third step in order to finish the second step. Hopefully that makes sense. Basically in these three spots, you're just going to add a dot right there right there and that right there so yeah that is it for this challenge hopefully this video was useful and helpful for you guys and if it was please give this video a big thumbs up comment down below any other challenges you guys want me to complete for you guys and i'll try to get to them and yeah i'll see you guys in another video